It is the year 2026 and six cow missions will fly to Duna. Here you can see me launching the first tanker starship that will refuel one of the cargo starships. The booster is now returning to the launch pad on the booster cam. In order to control six starships at the same time, I installed a mod called Burn Together. This mod allows you to select a ship as a leader and the others will follow it. There you can see the next tanker ship. I activated the mod and now the two starships are doing the same. There is the third one. The fourth. The fifth. And now six starships flying in formation. Quick burn test. And then I launched the first cargo mission. So in the last video we launched a cargo mission with a greenhouse on board and deployed it on the surface of Duna. And today there comes the rest of the base. I have really no idea why this booster didn't land on the launch pad. Then I docked the first cargo starship to one of the tanker starships and refilled its tanks. When I launched all cargo ships and refueled them, I started the orbiting and landing the tanker starships. Yep, that one failed. And now we have six refueled cargo starships flying in formation ready to head to Duna. Now we are time warping around to the next transfer window. We have now a maneuver node to Duna. And after almost a year of time warping, starships are still in the same distance to each other. And there we go, all six starships are burning their vacuum raptor engines. Look at that beautiful shot.
The starships reached Yuna and I stopped the burn together mod and increased the distance between each starship to area break one after the other. Here comes the first area breaking. After the arrow breaking I placed every starship in a 55 km orbit. Then I started the, the orbit burn on the first starship to land it at the base. You might notice there's a Kerbal on board the base module inside a cargo starship. That was not intentional. In order to remove the Kerbal, I made a quick save, ended it and reloaded it. Now the Kerbal is gone. And here I landed the last cargo starship at our base. Now we have seven starships at the same place on Yuna. Then I started to deploy the different payloads. This is the fuel production and mining part. And next came the fuel truck and that will carry the fuel from the propellant production to the crew starship that will visit the base with the Kerbal's next video in order to refuel it. Here is the first habitat module. And now I deployed the last module, which is the science module. The Kerbals that will land here in the next video will start to refuel their ships and setting up the base. Please click subscribe if you don't want to miss that one. If you want you can leave a like. Thank you everyone for watching and see you in the next one. Bye.